The International Court of Justice's recent advisory opinion purports to establish legal grounds that would allow nations to sue one another over climate damages. This represents judicial overreach that ignores economic history and threatens global development. The ICJ's ruling suggests countries can be held liable for historical emissions of planet warming gases. But how does one stack up the harm caused by a warming world against the benefits of industrialization? Critics of historical emissions ignore what those emissions purchased. British coal combustion, powered textile mills that clothed much of the world, steam engines that revolutionized transportation, and factories that mass-produced goods previously available only to elites. American industrialization followed, creating assembly lines, electrical grids, and chemical processes that form the backbone of modern civilization. These developments created knowledge, infrastructure, and institutions that benefited everyone. For example, the steam engine led to internal combustion engines, which enabled mechanized agriculture that now feeds 8 billion people. The International Court of Justice's liability framework threatens to undermine the very mechanisms that created these welfare improvements. Learn more in my article at humanprogress.org.